What's up guys, today we're going to be talking about coil on plug ignition systems. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. So I'm gonna give you guys five quick, brief advantages of coil on plug ignition systems if your car does not have one already. So a lot of the stuff that I'm gonna be talking about in the video is specific to my Evo, but these advantages can work for just about any other car out there if you do not have a coil on plug ignition system for your car. That was a mouthful, holy crap. So first advantage is horsepower and torque. If you have a boosted car, such as a turbocharged car, that means you can run more boost without any spark blowout. Which brings me to my next point, which is better fuel economy. So when you run more of a gap, you get better fuel burn. Instead of wasting fuel, you will actually burn all the fuel in the cylinder or as much of it as you can and not come out the tailpipe. I hope that one made sense. <laughs> So the third advantage of a coil on plug ignition system is better idle. In the case of my Evo, I did notice a difference. It pretty much smoothed out the idle because of the large cams that I have. And um, it made it a lot better, especially when I sit in traffic and stuff. The car doesn't shake like crazy like it normally does. The fourth advantage is it's a plug and play system. So no retune is actually needed. Although I recommend it because if you're gonna go through all the trouble of installing a cop kit and a couple of modifications like maybe a larger intercooler or anything else I would recommend it but if you're trying to replace a stock one then there's no need to retune at all all right and the fifth and final advantage is maintenance so what I mean by that is the kit that I have is a plug-and-play kit but it's so easy and quick to change out spark plugs it's ridiculous so we're gonna go ahead and do that in real time for you guys so you can see but I just want to give you a heads up in the case of my Evo I don't have a spark plug cover the factory one is hideous, so I decided to keep it out. Not to mention this kit that I got is carbon fiber, so I wanted to show it off. But if you want to go for the stealth look, this kit will work with the stock factory spark plug cover. All right, guys, we're going to do this in real time. I just want to show you how fast it actually is to replace spark plugs on this car. It's ridiculous. But the first thing you want to do before I start timer is, of course, you want to unplug your battery. If you ever do anything electrical in any car ever, always unplug the battery first. We're gonna go ahead and start the timer and put it down right here so you guys can see. There we go. So you guys can see how long this is gonna take. First things first, you want to unplug the kit or pretty much the wiring and all that fun stuff. Next thing you want to do Undo the bolts that hold the cop kit in place. Put it down. And then you kind of lift it, kind of finagle it. There you go. That's out of the way. We'll set it aside here so it doesn't scratch anything. And then we're less than a minute in. One spark plug. Of course, my tool decides not to be ridiculous. Spark number two. That one's stuck, holy crap. Difficulties of the tool here. Number three. Number four, and then put the new one in place, but I'm gonna do it by hand, because not everybody has tools. You guys may be thinking I'm cheating, but I promise I'm not. Drop it in, drop it in, drop it in, drop it in. All right, tighten it down. I'm probably gonna edit some of this stuff out. 
I apologize, but just keep an eye on the timer there. That's not gonna change at all. There may be some skips in the time, just cause I don't wanna keep this super boring for you guys, but I just wanna show you how long it actually takes to do this, it's ridiculous. This is like the worst extension thing ever right here. If I had tools that weren't gonna be so dumb, I'd probably be done by now. Jesus. Three minutes, guys. Three minutes in, and I'm on the, the third or fourth plug right here. Screw it into place. Ooh, shoot, drop the phone. Hold on. That one's in. The goal is five minutes or less. All right. New spar plugs are in. Let's go ahead and pop these back on. Pop the screws back into place. I'm even going through all that work. Ooh, am I gonna beat the time? Clock. Bam, 10 seconds left. Done. <laughs> There it is, guys. Less than five minutes. It's showing five minutes and three seconds, but less than five minutes to change out spark plugs, at least in the Evo. And if you guys are watching this, maybe you have an Evo already because you probably saw the thumbnail and it showed an Evo engine. Guys, that's it. That's all I have today. Thank you so much for watching. I want to give a big shout out to JD Customs. They're the ones that hooked me up with this cop kit. They even hooked me up with the carbon fiber plate to put it all together, which is awesome. I'm going to leave a link in the description below for JD Customs. They do DIY kits you can buy any part you want you can build it yourself or you can buy a complete plug-and-play kit from them and they'll send you one right away so thank you JD customs for sending me this badass cop kit that's all I have guys thank you guys so much for watching I am sweating already I think I'm gonna go ride bikes so I will see you guys in the next one peace